Oy vey. Hello guys. And this time I'll be doing reactions to Goblin Slayer episode 1 and maybe 2 as well. We'll see if I have the energy or the time to do it. Well, I have the time. If I have the energy, we'll see. Um, yeah, the only thing I know about Goblin Slayer is the thing I read uh, on X Sentai. I was, I was reading a pornography involving goblins raping someone and then someone in one of the comments kind of like, oh this is like goblin slayer so i looked up well, what you know or at least this is like the anime goblin slayer and apparently it's some kind of fantasy setting which i like and yeah when i tried to search for it apparently there's some controversy with the first episode so that kind of made me kind of go like you know what now i'm a little bit more interested in the show uh, because the name goblin slayer i mean it's it's pretty shit <laughs> it's i think it's a bad name uh, goblins are cute and you should have sex with them all right so, I mean, fuck, I'd have sex with a goblin girl. So, yeah. In this show, I want to see cute goblin girls get slaughtered. <laughs> Alright, that's what I'm expecting. Um, so, let's just start, right? Let's see. All right. So I'm guessing that's the Goblin Slayer. <laughs> okay, so that's probably some words that she's going to regret saying. All right, so she's a priestess or a cleric. The fate of particular adventurers. All right. I wonder who said that. Because that was not very well lip synced of those two guys with the bear. <laughs> porcelain. Yeah, you guys are as weak as porcelain or fragile. <laughs> All right, so what he is probably just a basic f fighter, warrior. That's a magician, a witch. I wonder what the black haired girl is. Because she kind of looks like 
a camp, a camp defender, something like that. Yeah, she's like, oh god, they don't know what they're getting themselves into. Alright, so I kind of get know what's going to happen now. Because of the beginning, she's still covered in blood. She was obviously in a cave. They are all going to die. Okay. It's kind of like, don't do swinging attacks. Oh, so she's a monk. Because she's gonna beat them with her bare hands. Uh, you overconfident idiot. You're leading them all to their doom. No, it's just it's a totem. <laughs> Don't split up. Come on. Wait for each other. Is she gonna get killed right now? <laughs> oh god, she's like, fuck! Come on! Good job. <laughs> Only a billion more. Jesus. <laughs> oh God. Oh God, the priestess, she doesn't know what the fuck to do. Oh god. Poor goblin. Oh. <laughs> Don't do swinging attacks. 
Oh, overhead swinging attacks. All right. That was some good foreshadowing. I should have seen that coming. <laughs> Your god is like, I don't give a fuck about you, all right? I'm not gonna give you any healing powers today. <laughs> is that an orc? Ooh. I mean, I can see where that guy was coming from. Oh god. Oh, she doesn't seem to have any wounds, so they I guess they didn't stab her there. Oh, and they're raping her. Okay. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> All right, I did not so I'm guessing that is the controversy, that there's rape. I mean, they're goblins, what did you expect? Probably goblins and orcs. Uh, she's already dead. Just put her out of her misery. Oh, fuck. A corpse is fine too. Oh, she's pissing herself. Hey, I don't know her name, but I would have pissed myself the moment I walked into that cave, so... I, I wouldn't even walk in there, alright? I would never be a fucking adventurer. In, fa in a fantasy land. <laughs> then we get some... It's like, that's my armor. <laughs> Oh, good job, Priestess. That was some quick thinking from her part. Did they bite off her nipples? So what is his name going to be? No, <laughs> all right. His name is just Goblin Slayer. I'm guessing that's his nickname he's using. I thought he would say, my name is blah blah, Goblin Slayer, blah blah. All right. She's dead. I oh, know it's just leather. Not that's probably not leather, that's probably cloth. Because if it was leather, it wouldn't rip like that. He did a merciful thing.
All right. Hobgoblin. So, so can she use three heals and three holy lights? Or is it just three actual magical abilities? And those are the two she has. Well, I don't know. She pissed herself. So there's probably a lot of pheromones on her. Will a little bit of goblin blood hide it? A good guy, he's looting. You're like, this is probably a sword I could use for something else, or I could sell it. I'm gonna loot. Uh, those totems are probably hallway markers for the goblins actually because there was one at the entrance as well <laughs> he's like wait Alright, actually, this is better than I thought, alright, I'll be honest. I had low expectations for this show. The name, and the fact that there was like some kind of, con I thought what it was called, controversy. I got, alright, I have low expectations, so let's see. But no, it actually, I'm enjoying myself so far. Especially since Goblin Slayer came came in. He's kinda of like showing this this noob how to do things. <laughs> like mind the trap as well. <laughs> Jump. Yeah, to make it so that they don't actually see the... Was that alcohol? What did he... Because it looked like it... It was probably oil. Alright, so they're just gonna keep coming there then, in probably small numbers, since they don't know where he is.
Oh god, that scared me. Go, oh kids. Well, got to burn them, burn them out. <laughs> oh, God. All right, so are there any goblin females in this show? Because I didn't see any cute goblin girls. So my assumption is that there are none. And since, well, they were dragging some of the females and raping them, I'm guessing the kidnapped human females are being bred to create more goblins. That's what I'm thinking. I wonder how much experience that gives him at the end of the session. Oh god, she's traumatized. So she's going to be part of his posse. It's gonna be him and her going out killing goblins. I hope we get to know his real name. Alright. Alright, she is determined now. Oh, uh, yeah, I think. Uh, the first episode, it was good. Um, I, I mean, fuck, I can't really think of anything negative to say about this, uh, this episode. I'd say it was better than I thought. I mean, I thought it, like I said, I thought it was gonna be shit. And, you know, because of the fact that I read I thought it was, uh, it's just gonna be some fucking standard fantasy shit. Um, but, yeah, I mean, I could be a bit boring if, in the future, all episodes are like this. You know, maybe it would get boring, but... I mean, I'm trying to find like something like, oh, maybe blah, blah, blah. But no, I enjoy this. Maybe it was because I had my bar so low. Because most things that are just popular, or the fact that the only thing I know about them is that there was a con controversy in it, tend to be trash. Because if that's the only thing anyone was talking about, then there's probably nothing much in it. But no, this had... Other things, I don't think the, what I at least think people were, the show contains, what? 
All right, so now they have done, <laughs> done a viewer <laughs> discretion is advised. Oh, all right. So after the first episode, they're like, oh God, let's, uh, let's put this in here. Uh, that's stupid. Come on. If people watch the first episode, then they should know what they're getting themselves into. Oh, whoops. And also, one thing I want to say is... Should I say it now? Yeah, I'll say it now. Why is what I'm guessing is the bad thing? The fact that those girls got raped by goblins, I'm guessing. Or maybe it was him killing kids, who knows? Or maybe it was all of that. Why is that any worse than the other shit that happened? You know? Maybe people didn't expect this much blood and all that to actually be shown... Hmm. I mean, I hope the show itself doesn't censor itself, like, deliberately. It probably wouldn't, because the show has probably already been finished, animated, and everything before they decided to release it. So I'm guessing this is just for the the subtitles and all that. That's what I'm hoping. Oh, it took me a fuck long. All right, so that's Goblin Slayer when he was a kid. So we're probably gonna see why he is the way he is. Did his best friend get killed by goblins? Oh, and they never got the chance because... Oh. Alright, no, she's still alive. I thought she was dead. Alright. That has to be Goblin Slayer, that little boy, right? Or is that just some other character that... Oh, it's English. I mean, I wonder, I hope that's not a combat system. Where they just roll one and sixes, or a d6, I should say. Unless it's a multi die combat system where they only use d6, that could be good. But if it's just a d6, then terrible. So that's going to be our main characters. Alright, I mean... That's a nice shot. 
a nice side boob. <laughs> oh god, those tits. Oh. Oh, poor Goblin Slayer. <laughs> Is he going to eat with his helmet on? He's like, oh. I mean, those tits. Oh, poor Goblin Slayer. I feel so... It means there are more goblins. Yeah. He would rather not there be anything for him to do when it comes to goblins. Oh god, this poor villager. He's like, fuck. I'm guessing... Yeah, the Goblin Slayer. Good. She's a good, a good, a good girl. She's good at selling shit.
Yeah, she's like, he's like, leave him alone, bitch. <laughs> Bitch. And a fucking seductive witch. That's great. I love seductive witches. Hey, he... <laughs> He's like, what's your point, bitch? <laughs> He's like, no. All right. Just give me all your Goblin Slayer shit. I mean... I mean, it's good that someone like Golden Slayer exists. I don't I do this shit because. Yeah, uh, he's like, hey, do you do what you want? I mean, I like Goblin Slayer. He's like, bitch, do what you want. Alright, I'm not gonna... I mean, one thing I'm wondering is, 
Yeah, she does know that he... That that guy is Goblin Slayer, because... She did say uh, it's even hard nowadays. A bunch of raped and dead women. And a bow. So that is what happened to him. Oh God. All right, they did it. Good job, newbie adventure team. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that spreads very fast. And they're probably just the scouts as well. I mean, I'm guessing the goblins probably sent out the young and inexperienced first to just scout out areas and all that shit. So that they can gain some experience. Yeah, and he's kind of like saying, I'm no different from a goblin. Instead of doing it to humans, I do it to goblins. <laughs> Alright, I like that slinger goblin. That was a nice shot. I mean, I like that he's using the bow like, like that. Because, if, for example, in my Dark Souls, in my Dark Souls Let's Plays and all that, I fucking love having a secondary range weapon, just to thin out the herds a bit, do some damage. As a fucking gas chamber. That's true.
Because you need to kill goblins, alright? Yeah, she's smart. I like that receptionist, I guess. Uh, you don't need to act like anything, alright? Just be yourself. So, uh, she's happy to see him at least. I mean, they could have given those butterfly wings a little bit of variation, but... Um, yeah, that was the first two episodes. I thought they were good. I enjoyed my time. I'm probably gonna keep watching. Yeah, that's probably what I'm gonna do. Because at the time of recording this, I think six episodes have been out, have come out. I don't know if I'm going to watch all six today. Because, I mean, two, two series that I'm planning on doing reactions to are this one and Index Season 3. And then whatever gets voted on the Patreon, you know. I think the three choices at the moment is Bakano, Arakawa Under the Bridge, and Konosuba, I think, are the three options. A bard. I love bards. So he doesn't give a fuck. Hey, at least some people, uh, I'm guessing the non-adventurers probably appreciate the Goblin Slayer, you know? Oh, and here's the elf. <laughs> elf! Oh, no, it's all three of them. Unexpected visitors. Alright. Fuck. Alright, yeah, I'm hyped for the next episode. I mean, between this episode and the first episode, which did I think was better? Huh. I mean, I think this one, actually, I think I enjoyed. Episode... 
I mean, I think you need to watch both of these episodes because the first episode is very good at just setting up kind of like the premise of what the show is going to be about. All right, fuck, that scared me. My mom dropped something. And now she's screaming. All right. Um... All right, fuck. My mom is talking on the phone, and well, when people older than me talk on phones, they always fucking talk super loud. So I'm gonna have to go there and tell her, "Can you lower your voice?" Um, but before I do that, oh, fuck. What, what what did I want to say? Fuck, I forgot. God damn it. All right. Other than yeah, I enjoyed this. I think these were two good episodes. I think the the thing that I read, saw and read about this a bit before I watched it, you know, because it was fucking impossible as soon as I searched on for the show just to see what the fuck was that guy talking about. The only thing I saw was fucking about controversy this, controversy that. Kind of like, fuck, if this is the only thing people talk about this show, this probably shit. Um... But no, it was good. So... Yeah. I mean, what... I'm not gonna talk about it. If people want to feel... If people want to feel however they feel, I think that's good. And if people want to express how they feel, that's also good. You know, I am pro just talking about your emotions and your feelings. I'm actually someone who is pro uh, feeling circles. I think that's good. If those people want to have a feeling circle and talk about that, I think they should go out and do it. All right. I think it's better to just say what what's on your mind instead of keeping it inside of you. It's kind of like why I feel so bad for Goblin Slayer in the fact that, well, he was obviously super traumatized about what happened. And... Yeah, I wonder if this show will be about him maybe getting out of his own mental prison. You know, with now when he's getting kind of more adventurers. I wouldn't call them friends, I would call them companions. Maybe more of his childlike personality might come out. Uh, that could be nice. I wouldn't want it to happen too fast. I would like, I think this show is, is said to be 13 episodes, so maybe that's couple episodes of this season, we can start seeing a glimpse of who he used to be before he became Goblin Slayer, that would be nice. <laughs>